South Dakota has joined a lawsuit against the Biden administration regarding the cancellation of the Keystone XL pipeline. Along with 20 other states, they allege that the cancellation was done unlawfully. Austin Gosh joining us now in studio with more on this story. Good evening, Austin. Good evening, Sam and Kelsey. Attorney General Jason Roundsburg's office announced today that the state would be joining a lawsuit led by Montana and Texas to prohibit the cancellation of the Keystone pipeline. The pipeline, which was supposed to travel from the southeast part of the state up into Montana, has been derided by critics as harmful to the environment and particularly unsafe to Native American tribes. Specifically, the lawsuit asks a district court in Texas to declare the executive order unconstitutional. The attorney generals on the lawsuit, who are all Republicans, are also seeking to prevent the Biden administration from taking action to enforce the permit revocation. I spoke to Roundsburg briefly today, and he explained to me why he decided to join that lawsuit. Security, it's jobs, it's physical security. I think there's a lot of things that can be uh, advantageous in having the Keystone XL pipeline go through. Uh, I'm very uh, sympathetic and understanding of the environmental concerns, but I do think, quite frankly, we'll have less trucks and rail and other forms of uh, environmental concerns if the pipeline goes through. Governor Kristi Noem has already endorsed that legal effort by the state on social media. It's possible that it could be months before a resolution is reached. Sam McKelsey. Austin, thank you.